Hey you guys, it's Megan Jennings. Um, okay, so today I am talking about my musical inspirations and influences, and I'm going to talk really, really fast because there are a lot of them. Um, you can click the links in the videos um, or in the uh, about the video box um, for uh, videos of these guys, um, well, these talented musicians. Before I start, please note that um, my terrible lack of talent is no reflection on their incredible talent. Um, I'm just a lyricist. I don't do music, but these guys um, have vibes in music and lyrics that uh, I really dig and uh, that inspire me to write the type of vibe I write for my lyrics um, and that I would want my lyrics to be put to music wise. Okay, so time to start again. I'm gonna talk really, really fast. Uh, first, we have Queen, brilliant. Um, Sticks, who I've seen in concert and they're brilliant. The Little River Band, which was a big band in the 70s, um, but people in my generation don't know about them a lot. Um, I have seen them in concert. They're awesome. You should check them out. Uh, another band that most people in my generation don't know that much about is Dead Eye Dick. Um, they were a one hit wonder. Uh, they had the song New Age Girl, which was their basically one hit. Uh, they put out an album. I only know of one album that they put out. My personal favorite song on it is Perfect Family. Um, it really has inspired me for my whole life. Um, of course, I can't mention inspirational uh, classic musicians without mentioning the Beatles. Um, then, newer music now, um, Daughtry, who I've also seen in concert, uh, and David Cook, again, I've also seen in concert. And then we have Evanescence, um, and Simple Plan, and Stained, and Matchbox 20, and Nickelback. Again, all of those um, are awesome groups that are very mainstream, but um, they've really inspired me and I like their vibe. Um, next, we have Jason Mraz. Um, who did the song I'm Yours, which is an awesome song, and he's really inspirational to me. And then we have Allison Krauss. Um, she plays usually with a band called Union Station. Um, I've seen them in concert as well. They are amazing. Uh, Allison Krauss is an effortless singer, and really it was songs that um, she chose to sing that she, she didn't really write any of them that I know of, but the ones that she chooses to sing um, it was actually those that originally inspired me to write lyrics. Um, so that's that's Alison Krauss. Um, then we have Fish, who they don't have many songs with lyrics that I know of, but they're an incredible group. Um, I love their music. Uh, then we have Reba McIntyre. Uh, she's amazing. Her lyrics are beautiful. Um, and she's always inspired me. And then, of course, Garth Brooks, if I'm talking about country music, definitely. Um, inspiring musician, just as awesome as he is and as iconic as he is. Um, anyway, so his music has, has inspired me, too. And then, very recently, I have been inspired by um, the next three groups. Um, so, first we have the Pierces, which is uh, a s set of sisters. Um... I love their sound, I love their music, they inspire me. Um, and then we have Pomplamoose, which I know I cannot pronounce that, Pomplamoose or something like that. Um, they also have a really cool sound, um, and I love their music. And then, very recently, I've been inspired by the Sons of Admirals, um, which is a group of four guys um, who individually are all musicians um, who do their own individual stuff but they work collaboratively together in the band called Sons of Admirals and I'm inspired really by all four of them individually and as a group so they're pretty cool. Um, so that is all the ones I can think of off the top of my head. I'm sure that if you that if I had more time that um, I could think of thousands more I can talk about good music for days on end. So uh, that is it for now. I hope to see you guys again soon. Uh, please check back for more videos and don't forget to subscribe. Alright, bye! Love ya!